Hey, it's uh, nice and rainy out here in Phoenix. Last two years, we've been getting really rainy win uh, winters, and I figure it's a nice day to take a hike. We're up here at Papago Park in uh, Tempe, uh, pretty close to my house, so this is where I come just walk around, clear my head, do videos like this. Uh, we're going to talk about the ammunition for the AR platform, and we're not going to talk about any pistol calibers. We'll talk about just the rifles. And... Uh, Think of the um, the rifle the rifling sizes as metric versus uh, imperial. Imperial would be like inches and feet, and metric would be like kilograms, centimeters. And so the most common is the 223 round for an AR-15. That .223 is actually 22 caliber. That's why you have .223. And then for a regular long rifle, like a 1022 or Ruger 1022, it takes a 22 long rifle. So that 0.22 for that little bullet is the same as the 0.223 for the uh, AR-15. And that's the caliber round, right? Now, that translates to 5.56 millimeters. So a 22 long rifle is actually 5.56 millimeter round just like the AR-15 .223. So really, uh, .22 is 5.56 um, in translation to millimeters. You'll also hear the term of uh, 30 millimeter rounds. No, sorry, 30 caliber rounds. Those are 7.62 millimeters. Uh, .30, the 30 caliber rounds. Those are like the 308.308, the 300 Winchester, the 300 Blackout, a 30 odd six, 3006, or the 3030. Um, they all start at .30, which indicates those are all 30 caliber rounds. And just like the 22 translates to 556 in millimeter, the 30 caliber round translates to 7.62 in millimeters. So in essence 22 rounds are five millimeter rounds and the 762 millimeter rounds are 30 caliber rounds i hope i said that right um i'm not really looking at anybody just so i in my peripherals squirrel uh so a uh i think this bush keeps moving i keep thinking it's somebody um hopefully the wind's not knocking the microphone out here so the uh 762 the 308 equivalent, the 762 by 51, 51 is the cartridge size. The equivalent is with the AK-47. Now the AK-47 is still 30 caliber round, um, but the AK-47 is 762 by 39 because the cartridge is smaller. So let me show you what the uh, the 22 looks like in this beautiful little valley here. We're up on a slight little rocky thing. So this is the 22 long Colt on your left. I'm sorry, 22 long rifle. And to your right is the 556 or the 223 in uh, for your AR-15. Now you'll hear people say that you can't chamber 556 and 223 barrel. It's actually you're saying that wrong. You can't chamber 556 in the chamber of 223, but you can chamber 223 in the chamber of 556. Remember, the barrels are the same. It's the actual chambering that makes a difference. And what's different with the 223 and a 556 is this upper port here where it, how it's shaped. So when it goes in, um, like I said, the 223 will sit in a 556 chambering. 556 will not work well with a 223 chambering. Uh, and also the 22, you can see, it looks like you know the AR is a little bit bigger but it's actually not those are the same diameter bullets for either one in fact you can get a you can get a little aftermarket thing to put in your AR-15 where it takes the bolt carrier group out and allows you to shoot 22 all right so now down here we have the three 30 caliber rounds or the 762 millimeter rounds here's a 308 you can see it's the 308 so it's a 762 by 51. The 51 is this bigger cartridge. All the way over here, this gray one is the AK-47 round. This is also a 30 
caliber round, but it's 762 by 39. So the bullet itself is close to the same size, same diameter, but it's the cartridge that's different. And then here's a 300 blackout. Same thing, the bullet is pretty much all the same size, 30 caliber bullet. Um, this is 7.62, and I'm, I forget what the denotion, uh, how it's denoted for the cartridge round with the 300 blackout, because we're so, so used to calling it 300 blackout. But these are all 30 caliber rounds. These are 22 rounds. And just like uh, with the 300 blackout, lower part of AR-15, let me just collect my bullets here. Not nobody picking them up. Um, a 300 blackout lower will fit on the 762 or the 223. Uh, actually, all the lowers are the same. Let me just say it like that. So, if you have a 223, 556, 300 blackout, all the lowers are the same. For the upper, you know, the barrel for the 30 caliber is going to be bigger than the 22 caliber. And then you have your chambering on the barrel, which is um, where the bolt push the bullet into the barrel that's called the chambering and those are different as well so you can technically take a lower from any AR-15 and use it on any 556 223 or 300 blackout upper the other thing that's the same is you could use the magazines from a 556 a 223 a 300 blackout they're all the same magazines there's no difference with any of the magazines so that's why the AR-15 is such a you know, such a um, diverse, flexible weapon because all these different things work with it. And if you have an, a lower, which is actually the FL um, regulated or the federal uh, uh, firearms regulated part of it, the barrels are not. They're, they don't have serial numbers or they don't need to and they're not tracked. Only the lowers are. But I'm trying this all in one take. I think I got it. Only a couple of minutes left. Uh, so any AR-15 lower will fit on the different uppers. Now, the one caveat to that, the difference is, is if you have a uh, completely different chambering like the um, the 308 or the 76251, because those cartridges are a lot longer, you have to have a different lower, you'll have a different upper, the magazines are a lot bigger. And the same thing for the uh, 76239. Uh, AK-47, and I believe they're starting to make ARs that chamber in uh, the AK-47 round, which is a 7.62x39, which is a little smaller cartridge than the uh, 308, but it's very, very close to the same size as the 300 Blackout. It's just a little bit more powerful than a 300 Blackout. So, as we sit here looking at the beauty of Papago Park here in Arizona, near Tempe, or maybe it is Tempe, Scottsdale, one of those. Uh, we'll wrap it up by saying um, I hope you got something out of that. If it was a little bit confusing, the different chamberings, the rounds, and all that, uh, it's all pretty simple. And uh, hey, I'm gonna go enjoy Easter. I think we're gonna make some hamburgers tonight. I have a barbecue in this rain. That is the Arizona way. Peace.